I have with me our executive director, Ms. Uh, Judith Escamilla, who will be showing us around uh, the technology department that serves all our campuses, our departments, our staff, and our students. So, uh, Ms. Escamilla, can you tell us about uh, your department? Okay, well, I just want to say that um, McCann ISD's Department of Technology plays a critical role in providing um, the technology tools that every student and every staff member needs to be successful in our district. But with some of those things, we're having to do some enhancements, and one of the enhancements is our new operating network operating center, and I'd love to show it to you. I'm excited to see uh, the entire department so that we can showcase uh, your department to our community and the things that you all are doing for our students and our staff. Awesome, thank you. Let's walk over. It's still in the works where they're currently working on some of the enhancements, but I'd love to show you the progress. Knock, knock. Thank you. Oh, wow. I'd like to showcase this room. We started with the raceways. At least this is the beginning of that. We have some of the UPSs that are going to uh, help us with the equipment. Okay. We have some cabinets on the other side. And um, of course, you can tell that it's still in the works. We have some people still working here mm -hmm. to complete this project. But they're on the right timetable, and we're hoping to be moving in a very short period of time. This is going to be uh, where the main computer systems for the school district yes. are going to be right here in this room. Correct. We're going to have all of our hardware equipment for that sustains all of our services for the district when it comes to servers, when it comes to all the networking. We do have a very impressive uh, network for the district where we have two uh, diverse paths to every campus and we have two different data centers or network operating centers so we can have two internet connections at any time. And we have a dynamic uh, staging so they're able to change up at any time in case there's any issues with the fiber. This room is gonna be one of the state of the art. Some of the uh, solutions that we're using here are cutting edge and uh, we're looking forward to having this as our primary data center. Awesome. Yeah. We have Arturo, he's our project manager for Noble and uh, I'd like for him to kind of go over some of the solutions that we're, we're going to put in place which are these cabinets here. Arturo, would you like to? Yes ma'am, how's it going? Yes. How's it going? Um, so uh, the main goal for our job here is to be able to power up the entire uh, system or for y'all just in case we were to get any uh, hurricanes, major disasters or anything, the generator we have outside will kick in and all behind us will be the cabinets for all the H, uh, sorry, for the cat fives so we can go ahead and uh, continue powering the rest of the school. So let's say we were to have a major event where we go out of power for like a week like last time and um, well Judy and her team will still be able to work and be able to conduct anything they need to with the network system that we're installing. What is the approximate cost for the district for doing this project because it's uh, long overdue to to be able to uh, up, uh, upgrade our, our, our technology center and, and our operating center, but what are we looking at as far as the cost of, of having cost, our own The upgrades? cost for this uh, great um, solution and for us to create these type of uh, services is about $1 million that we're spending on this particular uh, room. But it is a room that's been an essential need for the district, and it is great that we finally have the, the, the type of solutions, the technologies, and the type of resilience that we needed for a very long time is now here in-house within McAllen ISD. This is a 1,500-gallon diesel tank, and it's made to run for about a week, a little bit more if, if uh, loads aren't too heavy. Um, we also do have, on the other side of this, um, we do have the in-roll cooling system uh, hookups and also the HVAC hookup just for, specifically for this room. So this generator will specifically only power this room uh, whenever everything goes down. Um, and, and it's made to last for a minute. And uh, Mrs. Camilla, uh, be, before, uh, when we didn't have the, our own generator and we didn't have our own uh, operating center, we had to depend on, on uh, other entities to, to help us with the technology? Correct. Uh, we had to take uh, uh, an initiative. We created a great partnership with the city of, of McAllen and we're leveraging the public library because they do have a generator. They do have the UPSs that we need to be able to provide the services that we need for our students and for our staff. So we want to be 24-7, 365 and not have any issues and have the best uptime. So those are, these are some of the things that we have to take to be able to provide those services. And it's exciting to see that uh, in McAllen ISD, uh, our technology uh, department continues to evolve, continues to improve, that continues to be innovative so that uh, we provide those services that our teachers 
our staff needs, our department, but most of all for our kids to benefit with their tablets, with their devices, and have state-of-the-art technology in the classroom. Thank you so much. Thank you.